Am I on? Yes. Okay, sorry guys. I'm I'm uh, recording from my daughter's computer because I'm having some technical difficulties with my computer with the camera. So I know that everything is probably delayed it looks like on what I am saying. So hopefully if it comes out horrible, I'm just going to try to delete it before anybody actually sees it. So we'll see how it goes. I just wanted to respond to the Soap Sunday uh, questionnaire that Kaya Journey had posted on Sunday and I did want to participate to support her on that and if you haven't checked out um, her channel it's uh, I'll I'll leave it below but it's Kaya Journey K-A-Y-A -A, Journey and the first question she asked was why or how did you choose your name as far as for my business? And I have two different businesses um, that I run online and one is my soap business and one is my jewelry business. My jewelry business I've been I've been making jewelry for over 10 years as far as soap uh, about four so um, with jewelry my I had initially named it Spirit horse designs because my horse's name is Spirit and I wanted it to have a somewhat kind of you know spiritual um, name to it too and so the two just kind of went hand in hand so I called it Spirit Horse Designs for several years and then when I went to go online on to um, I, I did Art Fire first and Art Fire I, I had I have spirit horse design had spirit horse designs when I went to Etsy it was taken so I had to do black horse designs so I did now have both of my both of my jewelry I have a black horse designs for Etsy and a black horse designs for Art Fire and the reason I changed it to black horse designs was because of my new horse that I got a few years ago my uh, black Mustang. Uh, Cuervo and um, so I decided to go I wanted to keep it with the theme of my horses because that is very spiritual horses are very spiritual to me and so I decided to go with black horse designs as far as for my soap for wicked sensuals well that um, that there it just I wanted it to represent something that had to do with Maine and I wanted it also to I wanted to give it the effect of like it's you know sense like kind of a sense but it's very um, you know uh, you know sensual so I decided to go with wicked because up here in Maine there's a saying it's wicked it's wicked and I remember I was born and raised until I was a teenager in Kansas and I remember when we moved up here to Maine everybody <laughs> was saying it's wicked or it's wicked good it's wicked that that's wicked <laughs> and I remember thinking it's bad it, you know it's wicked it's bad it's evil and <laughs> it just ends up wicked means like it's really you know it's like <laughs> so I decided to go with wicked and then sensuals but s-c-e-n-t so you get the scent factor in there so wicked sensuals and it's it stuck so um, number two what other names did you have in mind and I already touched on that for my jewelry um, spirit horse designs and um, for my for for the soap I really didn't have any other names in mind that pretty much fit from the start and I kinda stuck with it I do have, um, you know, I do have a, um, to my website, which isn't completed yet, still under construction, um, I have a sub website to that for, uh, I believe it's Main Bath Bar, Be and there's a reason for that, but I haven't really started that up yet, so I'm not going to touch on that too much. 
Um, do you, number three, do you still like the name or have you thought about changing it? And neither one of them know. Black Horse Designs, I really, really like it. Um, you know, it has, it has the, um, you know, the horse part in it for me and it's, you know, it still touches on one of my actual horses, so no. Nope. And Wicked Sensuals, no, nope. it's stuck. I like it. I'll probably never change it as long as I'm selling soap. What do other people, uh, number four, what do other people think about your name? Um, you know, people haven't, I, I don't know as though they've really, I think when Mainers, like when my friends and other Mainers find out what the name is, Wicked Sensuals, they kind of chuckle, you know, because they get it. Um, other people, I don't know. I don't know if they really get it because maybe it's possible that they think, you know, Wicked Sensuals, like, ooh, it's, it's wicked. It's just like, you know, witchcraft or something, <laughs> which I assure you I'm not. Um, but no, so, you know, but yeah, <laughs> I don't know what else to say on that. No, I don't really get a whole lot of um, people, I haven't had anyone really ask why I call it that or anything, and like that Mainers really get it, and um, other people haven't really commented on it much, so. Uh, so, uh, that's that for my, my video response. Hopefully, I'll be able to figure out how to connect this as a video response to um, Kaya Journey's channel, hopefully. Not really savvy that way, but I'll try to figure it out if this comes out good. All right, so let me see if I can shut this down. All right, thanks for watching, guys. And um, I hope you got some other responses to this. Um, and I will talk to you later. Have a good night, guys. Bye.